Yeah? Yeah. Oh my word. That is a high quality fish. Time to get our guy in there. Ooh, ooh. Hopefully this bag does not break. Here we go. Oh, 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 God. What up Slayers, it's actually the same day. I am trying to crank out as many videos as I can guys. I'm shut up seatbelt. I know, I know that I'm having a tough time trying to record. My camera girl is not here unfortunately and Zach's not able to help me. But guys, we're going back to the Tropicana flea market to that tropical fish place by Mikey Rivas. He has harassed me, like I left probably about 20 minutes ago and I'm on my way back and he told me, hey bro, you know what? Come and pick up that marble goby slash sleeper goby, which I still don't know if that's a goby or what it is, but it's insane. I had just set up that 40 gallon. I think we're gonna go ahead and put them in there. Let's go ahead and, and shoot over there real quick. And I can't wait to pick up my new pet. And we're back. And there's a lot of noise going on. Hopefully he can finish cleaning. Guys, this is this is the place to go. DM Mikey, because he has birds. He has, he has the connects to get you some pretty awesome Little fish, guys. It's it's pretty cool. Long time no see, bro. I got, I got something for you, bro. Yeah. Yeah. What's he got going? Oh my gosh, dude, this thing's insane. He comes all the way up too. This is crazy. Look at him. Oh, he let pick. He let you pick him up. Yeah. Oh my gosh. You really are gonna go ahead and give me this, man? Yeah, take care of him, man. Dude, you're the, you're the best, dude. I really appreciate it. Did you get anything new since I left 20 minutes ago? <laughs> Just in case you guys didn't see the last video, be sure to check that one out because it was it was pretty far. We fed we fed some fish on top of that. He showed me the whole store, but we'll go ahead and do a quick walkthrough one more time. He has tons of birds. Parakeets, pigeons, canaries. Whole bunch birds. of awesome stuff. There's a Mikey Revis on top of the... He comes with the store. But uh, look at that, oh, beautiful canaries. You have amazing cichlids. If I can get out of the glare, maybe I tried my best. You can see the colors in them. We'll walk around real quick. He has these awesome pigeons that he pimps them out. He's a, he's a pigeon pimp. Yep. Like look. Bring me back female pigeons. Oh, look at that. So we have other stuff here. You have this little cichlid that's in this cool tank. You can't really see them, that's crazy. Goldfish for great prices, kois. Oscars that just swim against the glass that are just ready to go ahead and eat. Oh my gosh, that's insane. Look at him go. You have this beautiful flower horn that's so scared of me. He still hates me. I don't know why. Look at Grandpa Oscar right here. He's got a size, good size comparison of my hands. He's got big hands. So we're going to say it's a really big fish. He's got baby hands because you catch baby fish. Nah. Micros. Micros only. Again, check his Instagram. If you guys want any of these fish, like I said, 90% of these fish are for sale, unless they say not for sale, but for the right price, they're for sale. You know what's up. Yeah. Exactly. Breeder pair of Oscars, beautiful flower horns. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. Just wants to come home. I was coming back to get you eventually, but uh, you know what? I still might have to come back. Whoa! You have the poise back there. That's some uh, red tails. There's red tails in there? Oh, I see him, he's lurking. He's lurking, you can't really, oh yeah, you can see him now, he's lurking. Juvenile Oscars, Oscar fry that they raise. They raise a lot of their fish in-house. It's amazing. Like, look at that. Goldfish as well. This is where the demon laid. Now he's in that bucket, which will take him home very soon. The flower horn back there. Beautiful red dragon. He's super, maybe he'll pop up. Hey buddy, oh yeah. That's a really active red dragon right there, guys. Wow. And guppies, cobra tail guppies. Look at the colors on that one. Blue. These were all uh, red at my house. What? In a little pond that I got in the back of the backyard. No way. I might have to copy on that one and breed a whole bunch of cobra tails. I know with the right conditions, these things breed like crazy. Almost like rabbits. I still trying to figure out what that is. Help me out here. All these flower horns in the, are in the same tank. That usually does not happen. But they coexist, believe it or not. That's that's pretty crazy and a good price. 35 doll hairs. That's that's not that bad. Look at this guy. Why are you looking at me, man? Hey, that's right, I'm talking to you. He almost looks platinum. 
Dude, you might have to come home one day. I might have to be back. My girlfriend might really, really like this fish. Like, for real, dude. Like, that's a really pretty one. Like, for real. I'm not joking. Like, for real. We got the brown hole blows. This weird, weird thing right here. Still haven't figured that out. This is a gem. Fortunately, he's not for sale. But, oh my word. That is a high quality fish. That is an insane fish right there, dude. Texas cichlid at its finest, bro. I am really mad that you're not gonna let me have this one, but I don't blame you. That is, that fish deserves to be in your home, bro. That is amazing. You got a little catfish here hiding in the lurch, but this is the real piece de resistance. Oh my gosh. If you guys wanna see the remainder of what's going on, it's really hot in here, because all the water and stuff, but if you guys wanna see what else is in here, check the last video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Again, if you guys want fish, DM my boy Mike Revis. We're heading home with our new fish and put him in that new 40 gallon. Dude, look at this thing. Someone found a home today. He's getting that IG post. I'm filming you while you're filming me. Don't film me. <laughs> look at this thing. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. That's so scary. You're dangerous, man. But again, bro, I really appreciate it, bro. Thanks again for everything that I really do. I can't wait to get you home and crush you some fish. Look how angry he is. He looks so mean, so aggressive. Oh my gosh, that's so scary. Look at that. Oh, he's so flared up. Wow. All right guys, we just made it back to the house. Look at this guy, oh my gosh. He's insane. Get the bubblers going, he's okay. I know this is not like the ideal transport thing but i have a strong feeling this is a marble goby it definitely in the goby family but guys if you know exactly what it is please let me know in the comments below because this is nuts all right what up slayers we just made it upstairs after the transport waited for my beautiful girlfriend to come by she's behind the camera right now here i'm gonna show you our newest pet guys babe come check this out i know it's the first time you've seen it but come check this out Ooh. Isn't that interesting? What is it? I think it's a marble goby. It's definitely a fish in the goby family. I've been telling the viewers the exact same thing. I'm trying to figure out for myself, guys. And please let me know in the comments below exactly what type of fish this is because it's going to be our fish. And of course, I want you guys to name it. So please, let's go ahead and start this off the right way. Let's go ahead and name this bad boy. Look at him. <laughs> He's so interesting, isn't he? His colors. He just stays suspended. He's insane. Yeah, exactly. He's scary. I'm, yeah, he is. He's vicious. <laughs> here is the finished product. Here is our tank. I guess our water posture here was pushing the sand and stuff, but I moved the rock here because, I don't know, I just didn't want it with spud, 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 spud. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Look at him. Isn't he like all cuddled up He's and stuff? He's all burrowed in He's there. He's all burrowed in there. Isn't that crazy? But here, oh my gosh, what a Tell cutie me. pie. I added more sand, as stated before in the previous videos, and I removed the rock because he didn't, you know what, he never really got in the rock. He, ne he never really got in the rock, so. But now he's in here, he's doing good. And then I filled up the tank, did a little water change real quick. We're gonna clean that later on, but let's uh, let's go ahead and get our new guy acclimated. I'm excited. Why? I want him to thrive in this tank. I know. Isn't he and cool though? He's giant. The tank is giant. Yeah, you're right. But look, guys, you know what? Oh my gosh. Here, Lily, check this out. Ready? Check this out. Turn around. Oh, it's too bright. <laughs> it's really bright, isn't it? Isn't that sick? It's insane. Guys, this is so cool, isn't it? It's awesome. So now we gotta go ahead and acclimate our new guy. Come check him out. Look at him. Isn't he so cool? Oh my gosh. All right, cool, we got our bucket. Now, I'm gonna get this big, big bag I have. So we can go ahead and act them appropriately. So, we're gonna go ahead and put this bag right here. And I'm gonna pour the water that he's in into that bag, okay? All right, so now we're gonna pour this water in this slowly. So he has enough room to swim around, but also, we can put him in the tank to acclimate accordingly. Check him out. Come close. How cool is that, right? Wow. Oh, never mind. Ooh. We'll check him out when he's in the tank then. Sorry, we're gonna go ahead and try to catch some air real quick. 
and I'm just gonna twist this a little bit so it will not and then we're gonna go ahead and put them in the tank so now time to use my trusty app to turn off this light check it out oh that's so cool <laughs> the little things in life that just make me happy <laughs> so now we're gonna take this light off everything the water is good to go it's fish safe it's a nice 83 degrees here I have one of those fancy heaters that have a thermometer with it so it's really nice Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Alright, and then this is that lid I told you guys about. Here's that egg crate. Easy, lemon squeezy. You can just take it off like that. Good to go. Now let's go ahead. Oh, let me just throw that there. <laughs> Time to get our guy in there. Ooh, boy. Hopefully this bag does not break. <laughs> it's like a balloon. <laughs> Alright. Now we're just gonna lay him right here. Should be good enough. The water is like right at the brim. Oh, oh god! Here, come check out the water level. It's freaking me out a little bit. It's like right there. We're touching water. <laughs> That's scary. So he's gonna go ahead and act me. Oh, look at uh, the color under his belly. Oh. Wow, what a pretty fish. Um, acclimate, do his thing, and then after we'll go ahead and release them. Wow. Look at the patterns on this fish. He's so crazy, like look at his eye. Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> this is so cool, I'm so excited to get this guy in his new tank. All right, look at this guy. This is crazy, this is actually really heavy. Let me get him this bag in here real quick. All right, we'll just open up the bag really quick, just like this. We'll scoop him right out. Look at this fish. Wow. Look at the colors on this guy. Isn't he amazing? <laughs> I'm so excited. You see him? Wow. Isn't he amazing? He's so cool. Let's go ahead and get him in the water. Check it out. Check it out. Oh, look at his new home. This is so sick. All right, let's go ahead and get the lid on there and the new light so you can really appreciate him. All right, now we're going to go ahead and put this nice makeshift lid, guys. I'm telling you, it's amazing. It's so easy just to put on. And there you are and our super super nice light as well we're gonna go ahead and put this right here and right here perfect it's also adjustable if you want you have bigger tanks it's amazing and uh time to get my trusty light check it out oh my god look at him look at this fish he's so cool look at that this is a lot more spacious than his previous tank, he was only in about a 10 gallon. But wow, guys, this is amazing. Again, name him. And then here's Spud chilling right here. Spud hasn't eaten since the last time we fed him, so how do you feel about feeding him now? Let's do it. We're gonna go ahead and get some faders from Petco and be right back. Many, many, many thanks to you, Missy, for getting us the required feeders for Spud. Now, right. let's feed him. Alrighty, alrighty. Okay, here we go. Now grab one of these bad boys and send it down the hatch. Go, 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 go. Sorry. Dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Oh! Our new friend wants something. You know what? He might be hungry too. Down the hatch. Go, 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 go. Go forth. Spud sees it. He's tracking it. He's tracking it. He knows what's going on. Here we go. Oh, 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 gosh. It's over. I can't show that. That's over. <laughs> toast. Texas toast. That's oh. it, guys. Spud oh. is a savage. And you look back. Not even a single flake to be found. You, my friend, are a monster. Look at that bulge, you fatty. He's <laughs> so happy. Are you full, bro? I think you're full. Turn oh. around. We do not want to see your butt. Thank you, my friend. I appreciate you <laughs> listening to me. You know your leader. Silent like a ninja. Mm -hmm. You know what? Let's go ahead and feed this guy. He might be hungry. Let's do go it. Go ahead. Might as well. We got enough. Two and two. I almost feel bad for these little guys. Right. Give him that inaugural kiss. Go, go, go. <gasps> you won't kiss me with that mouth. <laughs> Drop it. Here we go. Dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> oh! Guys, this is gonna be an amazing fish. Did you see that? Oh! You should be sacrificed. Look. Send him. So long, my friend. Go to fishy oh. heaven. 
Waiting. Still waiting. Oh, here we go. Season. You ready to strike? Get ready to strike. Go. <gasps> See you later, boy. <laughs> nice knowing ya. Oh, so that's why he said still. Look how flared he is. What a beautiful oh fish. Oh my gosh. Isn't that awesome? He's a monster. He's a monster, guys. Oh. Well, go ahead and end it on that. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I sure did, guys. So happy for this new fish here, guys. Please, don't forget to name him. And let me know what he is, guys. Because we definitely have a good guess, but I want to go ahead and make sure. But I'll see you guys in the next episode. Booyah.